Ja. Ja. It's been so long. What's good? Okay. I know. I've been gone. I've lived my whole life, y'all. But I'm, I'm back. So, I ain't gonna talk too much, but we're gonna get into this tutorial. Like, what is it giving you? What is she giving you? Like, is she giving you bae? Like, is she giving you empress? Like, is she giving you queen? Like, yeah, you see this carbon? Like, but y'all ain't ready for that. So, <laughs> let me stop playing with y'all. We gonna get into this video, honey, because she is everything. It's the lips for me, like... Get into them. I'm, 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 I'm gonna get y'all a second to get into them. Okay, I thought so. All right, so without further ado, let's get into the video. Oh, and before we get into the video, do not forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell notification so you can get these notifications. Whenever I drop these videos, things gonna be a little different in here. The vibe is gonna be the vibe. You know what I'm saying? You see the candles. We got the sage. We got the crystals. You know what I'm talking about? So, but let me quit running my mouth. Bye, guys. Okay, guys. So, today, we're gonna do half of the face this time on video instead of the whole thing. So, you know, this is just going to cut down a little bit of, you know, time. Sorry if you hear my children in the background. I apologize in advance. Okay. So, of course, remember what you learned in math class. What you do to one side, you do to the other. So, that's exactly how we're going to do this video. You feel me? Let's get it. So, of course, we're going to start off with the eyebrows, you know. Feel her in, make her feel real, you know, lavish and plush. You know what I'm talking about? Because sis got eyebrows in real life. We just going to fill them in a little bit. Well, so we're going to jump into the concealer. So, we're going to put our concealer on both sides of our eyes and blend it in. Then I went in with a white jumbo uh, pencil and went all over my eyes. So once I put my eyeshadow on, it's going to pop, sis, because that's what we wanted to do. We needed to pop. So then I go in with my um, flat brush just to kind of like blend it out a little bit. And then once we finish that, we on to sculpting our, our eyebrows, sis. Because if you're not doing that to your eyebrows, what is you doing? What are you doing? We need our brails sharp. Okay. Okay. So, we're going to do the top and bottom of our eyebrows on both sides. Because like I said, once you do to one side, you're going to do to the other. Alright, so now we moving on to our eyeshadow. I started out with this gold color from this palette. But you'll eventually see that I end up switching to another gold from a different palette. Because everything wasn't doing it for me. So, do what's best for you and what's, what, what works for you, sis. But, this is what I did. Okay, so, after we finish the gold, we're going to go in with, like, one of these orange colors. I didn't know which one at the time because I'm super indecisive. But, as you will see that I chose the one on the far right. So, we're going to go ahead and put that into, like, our crease area. Um, I started with, like, a pad motion. So, I was kind of in between, like, a pad motion and, like, a sweeping motion. Um, padding is probably better, to be honest. But, see, they, they go to pat. They go to pat, pat. But, like you said, so, I mean, like I said, so, I was doing a little bit of both.
So now we're going to go in with this pink and we're going to put it on top of our lid. As always, my ghetto ass always end up using my finger. But it doesn't matter because this will give me the most pigmentation at the moment. Maybe when I get some new brushes, it'll be a different story. But I like my fingers, baby, and that's what I'm going to use. Okay, so we're going to pack that onto my eyelid. Simple as that. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and use this pink. It actually had like a purple hue to it. And I'm going to put that in between the two pinks that I already have. So once I finish putting that in between the two pinks, I'm going to take a blending brush and I'm going to blend that pink and that gold together. Alright, so we do blending sis. So we finna go ahead and add this orange that gives it a pop of color again. I really didn't know which orange I was gonna use. So whichever orange you feel is gonna work best for you is what you're gonna use, sis. So we're gonna go ahead and use that with our finger because like I said before, that's what gives me the most pigment. Alright, so once I finish that, I'm pretty sure I blended it again. And after I finish blending it, I'm gonna go in with my blue eyeliner because why? Because we can't. Now we're going to go ahead and get into this green that we put on top of this blue. Just to kind of make it pop a little more. Now I did end up kind of like drawing it out further. But you'll see that I'm going to take a wipe and I'm going to clean up that green that's like not directly up under my eye. Do you see the slight hesitation? Do you see it? See, there we go. There go the clean up. It's the clean up one one eight. Hey, it's a one one. No, I'm just saying. Eyeliner time. I assume most of us know how to put on eyeliner. Um, if you don't, then maybe we should do a video on it. So, boom, eyeliner. Um, normally, I will put on um, a pair of lashes, but I only had one pair left, and they was definitely not cooperating. So, we skipped that and put on mascara. So, now we're going to go ahead and add this liquid bronzer that I have, and we're going to use that on my T-zone area. And then, uh, for those of you who don't know, I have milk and magnesia all over my face. I was trying that for the first time just to kind of see if I like it. Um, I might try it again, and maybe it's a different way to, like, apply it. I don't know. Y'all let me know in the comments down below, below if, like, y'all use milk and magnesia, and if you do it over your whole face or, like, just certain areas. Because sis don't know. I'm just trying, you know, trying to look something new. But anywho, we're going to go ahead and blend in this bronzer. And we're going to go from the bronzer to adding our concealer on top. So, of course, we're going to blend it in like we do everything else. But I also use my um, setting spray this time. I kind of feel like when you use your setting spray, it kind of blends it a little bit better when your uh, beauty blender is a little damp. It doesn't have to be wet, but damp kind of does make a difference. I would suggest it. Now that we're done blending the concealer, we're going to go in with my foundation. Why in the hell did I do my foundation after this? Beats me. Like I said, this whole video is ass backwards for some reason. <laughs> but it's okay. Well, it's ass backwards to me. So I'm just going to apply that in all the places I don't necessarily have concealer. And then you'll see that I'm going to go back um, in with my contour. Because normally I do foundation, concealer, contour blend i don't know what was going on but i don't know i guess because it's been so long sis, sis forgot sis forgot how how okay how the pandemic has messed me up by the way but it's okay because she is back i'm back and i'm better 
why am I singing so much? Like, I can't sing, and I know I can't sing, but I'm going to sing for y'all today. And we coming in with the concealer. Hey, where we going to put it at? Our cheekbones, under our chin, our nose, and our forehead. And I got a little booty chin, so I like to enhance it in now and then. So, you'll see that happening too. So, once we go ahead and put this concealer where it needs to be, we're going to go ahead and blend it in. Just like we blend everything else. Okay? Okay. And I kind of did a combination of brush and beauty blender why because i wanted to okay do what you want to do do what feels best for you okay okay And sis, let me tell you, I don't know what was going on with my nose contour. Maybe I put too much, but it was not letting me be great. Okay, I had to freaking blend, 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 go back and go back and blend some more, honey. Because she was being ignorant. Okay, that's all I could say. But we got her together in the end. 